Boise City Council District 5 includes downtown Boise and everywhere in orange on this map. There are four candidates running for this seat, incumbent Holly Woodings, along with challengers Crispin Gravatt, Katie Fight, and Steve Madden. We found out what each candidate sees as the top issues in Boise. Woodings was elected to Boise City Council in 2017 and was a member of the Idaho House of Representatives before that. She says growth and housing are the top issues in Boise right now. One way she plans to address housing is by adjusting the zoning code to match Blueprint Boise, a housing plan developed in 2008. We need to take everything that we developed in Blueprint Boise, which was a very um, citizen involved process of just kind of envisioning what our neighborhoods are going to look like into the future. And we need to put that into city code as our zoning code ordinance. Woodings also wants to address homelessness by creating a housing first program like New Path, but for families. Steve Madden moved to Boise from California three years ago. He says the top issues in Boise right now include growth, affordable housing, public safety and homelessness. I'd like to see the funding stay in place for, for hiring quality people for the police department, give them the best training and the best equipment they need. On housing, he says government subsidized affordable housing should be transitional. And because housing affordability is a marketplace problem, he's not sure of a good solution. I, I don't want government to step in and rent control that and take the, the, the value opportunity away from the landowner, for the property owner. Uh, I'm just not in favor of that. Crispin Gravatt grew up in Boise. He's the chair of the Public Works Commission and is a renter. He says the top issues in Boise right now are climate change and affordability. I think that our zoning code rewrite presents an incredible opportunity for us to sort of build our neighborhoods and build our buildings in a way that mitigates our impact on our natural environment. On housing, Gravatt says there's two parts to housing affordability, housing stock and wages. And we need to make sure that our small local businesses that bring such vitality to our community are able to keep up with rising costs of labor, that they're able to pay their employees fairly so that their employees can live and enjoy the neighborhoods around where they work. Katie Fight has nearly a decade of experience working for Idaho Fish and Game and various environmental groups. She says the top issues in Boise right now include housing affordability, city actions related to parks and public land, and transparency and communication. The immediate actions include everything from setting up like a home registry to help bring seniors and others that may have room in their houses to be able to rent to renters that are seeking a place. The city is currently exploring this idea and tiny homes, which Fight also recommends. She says the city also needs to explore more mobile home and RV parks. Fight says communication is also important. And we need to make sure we involve our neighbor, our neighborhoods and our neighborhood associations and the full spectrum of nonprofits in moving forward right now in these, these difficult times in Boise. You can find more information about these candidates and other races on the ballot at our website, IdahoNews6.com. Anna Azalian, Idaho News 6.